Alrighty, so we have a few more teasers that have popped up on the building or have been there, who knows, for how long. Um, but it brings up an interesting topic of discussion. There are a few mentions of other parks on these teasers as well. There's Carowinds kind of mentioned in here maybe, and I mean, like, you guys have a read of these teasers and let me know what you see or think. And I'm also seeing now King's Island mentioned in here. So we have Carowinds, King's Island, and Canada's Wonderland. Now this brings up an interesting topic of discussion. Is Cedar Fair trying to link a massive storyline to all four of these parks? Um, I think yes. I mean, we see it with Canada's Wonderland. That teaser definitely hints at something like a kind of like frontier Cedar Creek um, Mining Co. coming into Canada and them starting this whole kind of a storyline in Canada's Wonderland that also matches with the direction that Canada's Wonderland's heading. It's almost brilliant if you think about it. And now that we see some other teasers in here with slight mentions to snakes and Mason, Ohio and other aspects of Carowinds as well, even in our teaser, there's like the 137 that could kind of be linked back to one of the teasers at Carowinds. It's like, what is going on and what kind of storyline do you guys think they're gonna tell? And I think it all comes back to the Cedar Creek Mining Co, which is super interesting. Um, now we know that Maverick or um, the storyline involving Maverick the Coaster and now, the St and now Steel Vengeance, I almost said the Steel Vengeance, GP, <laughs> involving Steel Vengeance, kind of has um, a part in this storyline that is heading into Canada. And it's very interesting because what could it possibly have to do with Canada's Wonderland, Carowinds, and Kings Island? How do you link these four massive parks into a storyline? And again, like I just said, it comes back to the Cedar Creek Mining Co. Is there gonna be this whole like, are two parks gonna side with each other? So is it gonna be like Carowinds and Canada's Wonderland on Maverick's side? And then you have kind of like um, Cedar Point and Kings Island on the Seal Vengeance team. And uh, this whole storyline of, you know, the Cedar Creek Mining Co is mining for gold to outdo, like, you know, Steel Vengeance and what they're here to do in Frontier to overtake and overthrow Maverick and his glory. Is that going to all be linked to this whole battle of the parks and storyline? And how? Um, it's so interesting. I want to know what they're going to do because it's like there's so much potential here and the teasers on this building are just phenomenal in kind of like getting you a bit excited for what these possibly could mean. I mean, what do you guys think? What do you think of the possible storyline surrounding this whole Cedar Point, Carowinds, Kings Island, and Canada's Wonderland potential storyline could be? What, what, what direction could they go? Anyways, let's get back to the teasers a bit. So we had a, a bit of a, a poor angle on the first image. And um, I originally said that, you know, it, it might be three inversions, 215 feet and 137 foot tall MCBR on the coaster because on the right side, I didn't see the comma. And I thought that was really the 3,501 foot long coaster, but it's the same on either side. So I no longer think it means three inversions and 215 feet tall. I, I think it's um, there's the potential of subtracting the two, which brings you to 286 feet. Um, I also don't know if that's the case, but there's lots of just interesting information on these teasers. Here's the Bonafide Barrel Co. Oak Strong and Iron Bound since 19, uh, so 1993, Mason Sandusky. Um, so again, this, this links the whole like Kings Island and Cedar Point kind of storyline. Barrels for all occasions. Again, I definitely think that's directed at um, Kings Island and um, I have no idea what it could mean. Definitely comment down below, guys. I need I need to hear from you, like what's going on? This is so much information on such a small building. Um, I haven't had the chance to fully dive in deep into all of these teasers and look for anything too specific and interesting. I just know there's definitely some mentions of Carowinds, Kings Island, Cedar Point, and Canada's Wonderland. And um, I'm just thrilled that Canada's Wonderland is finally being involved in some sort of epic teasing slash inclusion into like this whole like, you know, great coaster lineup and storyline and theming and all that. And I can't wait to see what happens on August 15th. As you saw, the park is starting to tweet. So go follow me on Twitter because we're interacting with the tweets and the teasing campaign and all that with the park management and PR and communications and all that. So definitely go follow us there because it's super exciting. So 
Again, you have it here, Daily Transportation to the Cedar Creek Mining Co. Now this is interesting, and I wanna hear your guys' opinion. Aboard L. Zistels. I don't know if that's a reference to Ziz, or if it's just in there and it means nothing, but um, this is weird, Young Reindeer. And Steamship Proven Safe and Reliable. That definitely, in my opinion, refers to B&M. I don't know, maybe, maybe not. I don't know, comment down below. That, that sounds to me like a B&M. 1863, since 1863, maybe that is reference to something. Daily operations from Sandusky Pier at 5.30 in the morning, returning approximately 7 p.m. We know that there are ferry operations that go between Sandusky, Ohio, or Ohio and um, Canada. And uh, a lot of people actually take that to get to Cedar Point. Um, there's the Thrashing Rapids. There's a couple of teasers we didn't get full pictures of. Um, so I'll be interested to see what those other ones say, like the one right there, Thirst, Thrashing Rapids, and Canyons. I have a feeling that's in reference to maybe um, Carolyn's Coaster. And then we have this whole dancing music and all that. And we know that Canada's Wonderland is potentially rumored to be getting kind of like a Harmony Hall style restaurant. Again, that's just a rumor and speculation, but who knows? Definitely comment down below. I wanna hear from you guys. What do you think of all this and how it links together? It's super interesting. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. There will definitely be more. Comment down below, give the video a like and subscribe if you haven't. Have a good one guys, bye.